hello dear students and welcome to this online class video this is the third part of 14th chapter how big how heavy of class 5 subject mathematics and i am jay prakash let's start the class now let's have an overview of today's class so today's first topic is how big is your cube second topic is packing cubes but before going on the first topic let's go to the previous page with the topic making a paper cube so here are some instructions you can see that using a square sheet having 19.5 cm each side we have to make a cube so we will get that its each side is 7 cm the length is 7 cm width is 7 cm and height is also 7 cm I have tried it you can also try it and here at the bottom side a statement is given that if we begin with a square paper of side 19.5 cm then we get a cube of 7 cm so now let's try to answer some questions how long is the side of your cube so it is 7 cm B is how many centimeters cube can be arranged along its length width and height so 7 cm 7 cm and 7 cm at all now answer Thimpu's questions so question is to make the first layer on the table how many centimeters cube will I use so as I have told you that lengthwise and breadthwise it was 7 cm right so in first layer so lengthwise he will arrange 7 7 7 7 cubes right by getting uh, 7 centimeter cubes in width so we will multiply 7 uh, centimeter with 7 so total 7 7 it is 49 now next is how many such layers will i need to make so we can see its height is also uh, 7 cubes so we can write 7 layers so the total centimeter cubes it means total means here we have to find its volume so volume of a cube is side multiply by side multiply by side so we will multiply 7 and 7 and 7 so 7 7 it is 49 49 7 it is 343 now the volume of the paper cube is same as 343 centimeter cubes now in the next page Anand made a big cube having double the side of your paper cube so we made a paper cube as its length width and height of 7 cm so Anand is making another big cube uh, having double side of our cube so double means 14 so here here is the Anand's big cube with length double of our cube so it will be 7 to 14 okay so length is 14 width is also 14 and height is also 14 because it's a cube and you can see this colorful cube it is our so it will be 7 7 and height is also 7 clear so first question is how many of your paper cubes will fit in it so here we have to check that how many uh, cubes are needed to fill this big cubes means Anand's cube so there are two ways to get this answer first is uh, by looking at the picture its concept is very clear that you can see that the half of 14 is 7 ok means our cube is just half of Anand's cube so you can see that in length lengthwise this is length so lengthwise one cube is filling its half so we need one more cube to fill uh, this cube lengthwise ok so one and one how many cubes we found two cubes ok and similarly in width you can see that one layer means one cube is just half of uh, the big cube so we need one more cube to fill this big cube width by width so 2 and 2 
length in length we got 2 and also in width we got 2 so here we will write 2 plus 2 so 2 and 2 4 so in first layer okay total we got uh, 4 cubes so similarly one more layer is there okay because its height is 14 okay and 14 is just uh, double of 7 so total two layers it will be formed so in one layer we need four cubes so in two layers we need eight cubes right so in this way we got it now let's have a numerical solution so how can we find it as you know that the volume uh, first we have to find the volumes of both cubes volume of Anand's cube so let me write volume of Anand's cube means V1 okay V1 means volume of Anand's cube so it is uh, 14 centimeter each side so its volume will be 14 multiplied by 14 multiplied by 14 right so it will be 14 14 ja 196 and 196 multiplied by 14 it will be 2744 uh, similarly now we have to find V2 V2 means volume 2 and uh, it is the volume of our cube and its each side was 7 centimeter so its volume will be 343 now so 2744 it was the volume 1 and 343 it is volume 2 so now let me write number of cubes okay number of cubes is equal to V1 by V2 so here we have to divide the uh, volume 1 by volume 2 so volume 1 is 2744 divided by volume 2 343 so after dividing these numbers we will get 8 so in this way we can say that 8 cubes are needed to fill Anand's cube so there are two ways and both ways we have tried to understand so you can use any one method to get the answer now next topic is packing cubes so let's understand it Ganesh and Dinga want to pack 4000 centimeters cube in boxes so these are to be sent to a school and there are three different boxes available for packing so box A, B and this is box C and the dimensions are given here remember that total uh, they need to send 4000 cubes ok so let's see in which box it will be fit so in box A let's find out its volume ok because we have to fill 4000 cubes so for that we have to find the volume so 20 multiply by 10 multiply by 6 just because of it is a cuboid so we have to use the formula of a volume of a cuboid so volume of a cuboid is length multiply by breadth multiply by height so we will multiply these all numbers 20 multiply by 10 200 multiply by 6 it is 1200 so we will write 1 2 double 0 cubic centimeter now come to B number so here you can see that only box A uh, is not enough to fill uh, 4000 cubes because its volume is only 1200 and we need to fix, fit how many 4000 cubes so A is not only enough now come to B let's check it is enough or not so its dimension are 11 by 11 by 10 so once again it is a cuboid so let's find its volume so for that we have to multiply its all side 11 multiplied by 11 it is 121 and 121 multiplied by 10 so it is 1210 cubic centimeter now come to C number this is C so it's also a cuboid so 15 multiplied by 9 multiplied by 10 so 59 that is 135 multiplied by 10 it is 1350 cubic centimeter okay we will write it cubic centimeter so we can see that B is also not enough to pack 4000 cubes because its volume is 1210 and C is also not enough and it is only 1350 cubic centimeter means 1350 cubes it can fit only so now what we have to do we have to add the all uh, boxes volume of all boxes to check that these three are enough or not so let's add these all numbers so we can see that 
the sum of 1200 plus 1210 plus 1350 is 3760 okay 3760 so this is the sum of this all boxes and here we can see that all three boxes are not enough to uh, pack 4000 cubes because its capacity is only 3760 means only 3760 boxes it can fit okay so means they need more boxes so now let's see what are they are talking Dinga is saying that uh, will we, will we be able to fit all 4000 cubes in these three boxes so its answer is no they need more boxes I think we need one more box for it yes now he is right so Ganesh is saying I think there is enough space in these boxes to pack all 4000 cubes Ganesh is absolutely wrong now what is your guess who is right Dinga is right now how can Ganesh and Dinga test their guess before packing the cubes in the boxes so it's a very simple way first they have to find the volumes of box A, box B and box C then they will find their sum okay in this way they can check their answer and here is a method to get the volume now next use Ganesh method and write so dash centimeters cube can be arranged in uh, box B so it is only 1210 one two one zero we will write here one two one zero now for here dash centimeters cube can be arranged in box C so its answer is 1350 only now last so dash centimeters cube in all can be packed in the three boxes here it is asking the, the sum of the uh, volume of uh, box A, B and C so it was 3000 760 so in this way today's topic is completed so see you all in the next video till then be safe be healthy jai hind